Today's a work day, gentlemen, and you know what that means? We gotta get better today. What I wanna know is, who's ready to work? I'm ready to work, are you ready to work? If you are, then go out and prove it to me. Show me what you got. Yo, what it do, you two? It's your boy, Jinto. We are here, man. This practice, we are getting ready for week seven. We got a game against the Seattle Seahawks. And I like this drill. Another simple drill. All we got to do is get five in a row. We're running the curl flats. We got this. We can get gold. We got to get that XP. Come on, get that catch. You turn around, open your hands, open your eyes. You got this. Nobody's near you. You know I'm not going to do you. I'm not going to do you dirty. But this is where we always end up blowing it. This is it. Just one more pass. Just one more pass. I see you. All right, man. Bring it in tight. Bring it in tight. Let me tell you something. That was the best practice of the season. Not a single mental mistake. That's the type of practice championship teams have. Keep it up. It's not a touchdown. They said get the touchdown, didn't they? If I'm not mistaken, they said get the touchdown, but I will take the goal. Now, the Seahawks are not going to be a pushover. They're 4 and 1. They, they've been putting in work. So we have 3,111 attribute points to play with. And I, I'm, I'm not playing around. We got to work on our deep passing. We can only get that up by one. So I guess we're going to actually have to get our medium pass up too. Actually, no, we can't. We don't have enough. So, like I said before, I'm going to work on my play action. It's my go-to move, especially when they start going in with the full, full-on blitz. And guys, if you're enjoying the career mode series, slap that like button. Now let's hop into this game. The hatred runs deep between these teams, and no position feels the pressure of a rivalry game more than quarterback. Can this fella look past the emotion of the game and deliver a victory for his team? It's the Seahawks going up against the Cardinals. Here we go. Their team overall is a little bit higher than ours. So we are the underdogs in this one. This is going to be a fun game. They're not going to go out without a fight. All right, here we go. Goals for this week. Air it out. 200 team pass. Protect the ball. No turnovers. Throw at least one touchdown pass. And we need four more for our season goal. So let's see what they do on offense. I got a feeling they're scoring. Yeah, so it just looks like my boy Andre Ellington. He's just replacing Johnson. Okay. They're playing up, so you know I'm looking at Fitz. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Almost an interception. Butterfingers. I don't know. I mean, was there an injury? I don't even remember what happened. Maybe there was an injury. There you go. You're wide open. Way too much space. Brown is gone. First touchdown pass of the night. Third down conversion. That's what I'm talking about. John Brown, he's seen the opening and he was gone. Let's go. I know the Seahawks. Yeah, I knew the Seahawks were going to score. That's what I mean. Like a team like this, they are they only lost one game. They probably had a slow start like we did. We only lost one game because of a slow start. And that was oh man. They saw it. Andre Ellington. He's no David Johnson. Maybe a screen right now. Yeah, I don't think I don't think a halfback screen would look good because Ellington, he hasn't really been that reliable. So I'm mm, much better. There's a first plus more. Second and six. Fitz looks like he's going to get this. He looks like he has the money right. So let's see what's going on. Let's see what happens. Whatever happens, happens. There it is. Larry Fitzgerald. Time to switch it up again. First and ten. They've really been bringing in the pressure. Like, I don't. Oh, look at this. They think the run is coming. They really think. Oh, no, 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 no. Wow, the defense of the Seattle Seahawks. This man, Cam Chancellor, was not phased by the play action at all. So the run is a little iffy. So we can't really expect Ellington to pull a Johnson and just go beast mode, right? <laughs> no pun intended. Seriously, no. Mm. No pun intended. Let's try that one more time. I kind of forced that so I can't be mad at him. That's all my fault. Floyd is actually... I could take the risk. Let's go. The pressure is on. I see the left side's open. 
That's what I'm talking about. Third and deep. That's that's two for two. We're two for two for the third down conversion. In the past, we would always choke it on the third down conversions. But this is a good start. I know one run they're not going to shut down. Fitz is actually... If he fades back, then I know exactly who to look at. Fitz is option number one. There's another one towards the sidelines. That's... Oh, nice spin move. That was a sexy spin. The spins just seem a little slow, but that actually got him. Third and three. We can't really afford to go with just a field goal. And I say that because they're going to score. They're going to get a touchdown. There it is. That's all you. That's a first down. That's a first down. And that's more than a first down. That's another touchdown. John Brown back to back. The Legion of Boom. The defense, I got to still give it to the Seattle defense, dude. And I know, I know Russell Wilson on offense. I know he's going to do something crazy. I might even slow down that play thing that that play simulation i might just slow it down just to see what russell wilson does like look at this they score again i, I knew it fitz Gerald has a plus one speed advantage and then brown he's headed towards the sidelines actually i don't like i don't like him going towards the sidelines i want him to actually slant because i see him right there he's gonna fade back i'm reading the defense he's gonna fade back there you go i called it nine four eleven my read game strong. <laughs> oh man, let me not get carried away and end up choking. Right? Come on. Uh oh, off the foot. Floyd catches it. I wanted to just scramble, but last time I did that and threw it off the foot, it was actually an interception. So that's why I had to stop and think about it before I actually took off. And Floyd catches it under pressure. So if Andre Ellington doesn't perform, it's my job to get him into the game, period. Because if he's not going to perform, oh, shoot, oh, shoot, did I speak too soon? I'm going to go with the hurry up. There's 37 seconds left. I'm going to pinch the line because Ellington, he wants, does he still want his touchdown? Nah, he doesn't really want his touchdown, so forget it then. If he doesn't want the touchdown, there you go, I see you. That's the first John Brown. Let me get that time out. See, I wish I could just control that, their drive goals, because every time we get so close to the end zone, I hand it off to him. Look at this. That could have been his confidence right there. You see what I mean? They always say, hey, let's get your 10 touchdown, rushing touchdown. Well, we're all the way, like, we're, we're, we're nowhere near the red zone. We're nowhere near it. So there's no way. But then once we get closer to the touchdown, right, nothing shows up. 14 to 20, we score before the half, and they go scoreless. I can get this goal right here for my boy Floyd. I can get this. I feel confident. I feel very confident with this one. There it is. I'm going to take off one of these possessions. I know I have to. I have to. Their defense is deadly, but it's third and two. I'm going to switch to a four verts. That short slant, that was too obvious. Oh, look at this, both of them, Brown and Floyd, both of them ready for it. Both of them ready for it. But I'm going to hand it off, play it safe, play it safe, Ellington. Our third down game looks way better than it's ever looked, and it's ironic because this is the defense we're playing against. Seriously. I'm lobbing it up. I'm lobbing it. <gasps> Sherman. You know what they say, right? You can't throw it on Sherman's side. I disrespected Sherman, dude. We got way too carried away. They, they're gonna score right here. I know they are. They're gonna make us pay. They go for the field goal. We got too carried away with that right there. You can't throw it on Sherman's side. That's a, that's a major no-no. That's a major fail. But the good thing about this, right, you, you, you won't you won't learn until you make your mistake. So I'm playing way safer this time. I can't afford, especially this close in the game, 17 to 21, you can't afford to give them any type of leverage. Second and six. I don't really want to. I don't want to just neglect my boy Floyd. Oh, look at this. It's time. It's time. Your boy's turning on the Jets against Seattle. We are in such a good position. Targeted four times. That's my boy Brown. Floyd, I gotta, I gotta respect it, man. Here we go again. 
Swing that to the left. You got to look out for the... Oh, nice. He broke one tackle. But he couldn't break the tackle from Lane. Wow. Floyd. There's three people on Floyd. But I see... The, I can sense the blitz. I can really sense it. I want to go with the max protect. Because I feel like they're bringing in that pressure. There it is. Another one. They aren't really protecting the sideline. They, they just aren't. They think we're going to keep lobbing it up. But little do they know, I don't have no deep passing. Third and nine. Wow. Hit him with the no huddle. Actually. Yeah, hit him with the no huddle. Mm. I kind of want to go for it right here, though. It's fourth and two. I want to go for it. But I'm going to play it safe. You can't afford no mistakes. You can't afford to get too cocky against this team. Shutting them down again on defense. Our defense is on fire. Actually, look at this. You know, you know Sherman is going to fade back. He's going to go back. Oh, shoot. That's wide open. Another deep bomb. Gresham never really gets that much attention. Third and 11, 17 and 24. They have no more timeouts. So that's game. After we snap it, after we hike it, we're going to kneel it. That was a tough game, dude. <laughs> you can't disrespect Sherman. You can't throw it on his side. You throw it on his side, you're going to be in for a surprise, and he's going to get that in every time. You can't disrespect him, dude. You just can't disrespect him like that. <laughs> But as always, guys, I hope you enjoy the Madden 17 career mode. I'm fired up after that game. I know exactly what we need to work on. Like that play action, there was no way we were faking them out. We hit them with one play action and we got sacked instantly. They did not bite at all. So I know exactly what we need to continue to grind and focus on. If you guys are ready for more Madden career mode uploads, slap that like button. Subscribe if you're new. Thanks for watching.